Today we're going to extract gold from the computer. And here's the gold containing chips that we found so far. And then we're going to dissolve the copper in a mixture of hydrochloric acid and hydrogen peroxide. So this is some of the gold dissolving in a 50-50 mixture of hydrochloric acid and hydrogen peroxide. I'm going to put in some more. Okay. few hours and I transfer it to a larger beaker and add some more hydrogen peroxide and hydrochloric acid. Um, most of the gold piece, pieces of gold foil are off. You can see them floating around. And I'm going to filter them out. After a lot of stirring you can see the gold foils all come up and I'm going to filter them out now into that other beaker. Okay, I'm going to rinse all the rest of them out now. Okay, after you've gotten all the water out of the gold and the acid, it should look like this. This is the gold solution after I dissolved it in a mixture of hydrogen peroxide and hydrochloric acid, which can also dissolve gold, and it's green from copper impurities. Okay. So now I'm going to filter the solution into some water. Actually, my ID can't off the top. Let's put it first. Now we're going to precipitate the gold by adding in some sodium bisulfite. Okay. The next morning, you can see gold at the bottom. Well, it's not gold color. So now I'm gonna pour off the liquid so I can recover the gold, then melt it down. So this is the gold that I got. Um, a lot of it stuck to the filter paper here. So I'm gonna try and dissolve that in a mixture of hydrochloric acid and hydrogen peroxide. That and then precipitate it out and not filter it so it doesn't get stuck to the paper.